What I am is a trainer. Really, you don't say. I prove I'm right by getting stronger and winning in battle. And even against the champion. Whatever you say, dude. But uh, Driftvale City awaits us. Ah, this calming music. I love it. So as you walk across the drawbridge, you're going to see these, these uh, little shadows here. If you walk into one, you will get ambushed by a Pokemon. Ducklet. This is where you can catch Ducklet. So if you want a decent water type or a decent flying type, then uh, consider Ducklet. Uh, you won't always find Wild Ducklet, though. You can get certain items. I'll try to show that off if I can get another shadow. There we are. A resist wing. There are seven wings. Uh, most of which um, boost your Pokemon's EVs, I believe. Genius wing is special attack. Resist wing, I think, is defense. I'm not quite sure. Another ducklet. Okay. Alright, we gotta get to the Pokemon Center because uh, I don't wanna... I mean, it just... I know poison doesn't do any uh, damage when the Pokemon's inside the Pokeball. But still, it just feels cruel to have a poisoned Pokemon just sitting there in the Pokeball. Ah, oh, this music. And right back to even better music. Welcome to Driftvale City. It is my honest opinion that this city is the, has the best music out of any city in this game. It's pretty catchy. Pretty catchy tune. And look! Hmph, so you're the trainer Zelisa was talking about, huh? I'm Clay. I'm the gym leader around these parts. Don't be expecting no welcome now. Because when we lowered that bridge, the Team Plasma guys we'd caught done escaped in all the ruckus. What a bother. We're grateful that you lowered the bridge, but how is it our fault that they escaped? You can say whatever you want, but what's important is y'all showed up and then Team Plasma escaped. Maybe it's a little heavy-handed, but you ought to start looking for the Team Plasma too. You're both talented trainers, aren't you? Tell you what, if you find Team Plasma, I'll let you challenge my gym. Life's all about give and take. Well, I suppose that's fair. But really, we would have looked for Team Plasma even if he hadn't asked. I can get stronger while beating that bothersome bunch. Cottonmouth, I'll go on ahead. Indeed you will. I need to make a trip to the Pokemon Center. It's an emergency. Now, as usual, when we go into a new city, we, um, or I, am going to spend a little bit of time looking around, talking to people, uh, trying to find, uh, pick up some items. I know for a fact there's some stuff you can get in Driftvale Market, so I'll go ahead and do that. Okay, uh, let's start with you. What have you got to say for yourself? The Pokemon of Lightning and the Pokemon of Wind are both known to come and go as they please. What could he be talking about, I wonder? I'm grateful that you came all this way. Are you a trainer? Ooh, you have a Pokedex. That's so marvelous. I wonder if you please do me a favor. I would like to see a Pokemon that learned a move called Rock Tomb. Uh, I've got three Pokemon that know Rock Tomb. Take your pick. Oh my, my, my. Your Krokorok can use Rock Tomb, and that's not all. My Sock and my Arkin can both learn it as well. Did he go into the trouble of teaching it to your Pokemon? Marvelous. This is a small token of my appreciation. Please don't hesitate to accept this. Heart Scale. Awesome. You can use Heart Scales to um, have a certain person make your Pokemon relearn a move it once knew. I wonder what Rock Tomb looks like when it's actually used. I'm sure you can use it skillfully. She won't always ask to use Rock Tomb. She'll ask to see, uh, I think, any... Just a random TM attack. You know, there are many kinds of Pokemon. 
different kinds of Pokemon, you don't say. Really. I wasted all of three seconds talking to you to learn something I already knew. In fact, that's common knowledge. What's over here? The reason I'm hanging out is because I want to hang around. If my Pokemon just knew the move Surf, I could go on top of the water. That's a hint. Uh, teach your Pokemon Surf. That there's, there is, in fact, an item over there that you can get. There are Pokemon that evolve when they're traded. Why do they evolve? Okay. Yeah, she's telling you if you look at a TV anywhere in the world, uh, you, you can watch TV shows, might learn something new. It's always been a mechanic in Pokemon. Never one that I've used, but it's there. Ahoo! Ahoo! You have a Pokedex. How many Pokemon have you found? Hoo-ha! You found 50 or more. Now we're talking. This is for you. A shell bell. Okay. I'll take that. A Pokemon holding a shell bell recovers its HP a little bit if it inflicts damage during a battle. What's more important is this. Have you shown the Pokedex to a professor? No, I have not. Let's jump on this. We'll trade my Basculin with your Minchino. I don't have a Minchino. Basculin, though. That's pretty cool. At this point in the game, you can't get them because you don't know uh, Surf. Hey there, trainer. Have you ever battled the Elite Four of the Pokemon League? You can't battle them unless you have eight gym badges, right? Hint, hint. A bit of uh, foreshadowing there. Guess who's waiting for us at the end of the game? Hey, uh, the professor gave you a Pokemon to start your journey, indeed. If that Pokemon is still with you, and if you two have a strong bond, there's a special move it can learn. Want me to teach it a battle combo move? No thank you. Fire Pledge, Water Pledge, and Grass Pledge. Those are the moves he will teach you. They are not very strong, but they double in power if you use them together in a double battle. Not to mention, if you use two different pledges together in a battle, they create an effect that uh, lasts a couple turns in battle. I've never personally witnessed that, but a uh, bit of trivia for you, I suppose. Uh, yeah. Three moves create a special effect if they're combined in battle. Yep. Pretty much just summed up what I said. Anything in here? A terrific trainer. Let me share a training tip with you. During a battle with a trainer, even if your Pokemon's items are taken away, don't worry. It will be returned to you safe safely after the battle. But disposable items seem to disappear. I work in the cold storage. The cold storage is in the southern southernmost part of the city. Indeed. I don't know why I'm saying that so often in this recording session. Those Team Plasma meanies forced me to battle them, and when I lost, they stole my Pokemon. Yes, that is, it. That is definitely the um, underhanded kind of thing that they would do. Alright, let's head into the market. Oh, there's a hidden item. Right in front of this lady. Oh no, right there. Heart scale, okay. Uh, you here. You! Glad you came. You want something good? Don't worry, it's not drugs. Then show me a Pokemon level 30 or more. Oh, strong! You, great! Take this! Expert belt. Uh, luckily my, uh... Luckily Rudy leveled up just before I got here. Um, and this lady is someone I always make sure to visit. This is straight from the farm. Moo Moo Milk. One bottle for 500. Will you take one for your trip? I'll take a dozen. Moo Moo Milk is a great healing item. It heals 100 HP. So even though I still have those lemonades left over, uh, yeah, I got some Moo Moo Milk to help uh, back it up. Okay, we'll ignore him for now. In head inside this entrance and grab this item. A big pearl. You can sell that for a bunch of money. Alright, uh, now, we will switch, um, don't want Rudy, Malfoy, Black, and Petrie, those are the Pokemon I have in front. Now we'll talk to this, uh, doofus over here. I'm a heartbreaker, my name, Charles. I wanted to get the attention of a girl I like, oh, there's nothing new, so I learned a new style of Pokemon battling. 
Its name, Rotation Battle. Want to learn about it? In Rotation Battles, you send out three Pokemon at a time and battle. One Pokemon takes the lead position, the other two stand on each side. The trick is, each turn you can change their positions, and that's a rough explanation of Rotation Battles. I'm a heartbreaker, my name, Charles. Hey, if you're a trainer, how about a Rotation Battle? You've got a good attitude, don't you? Yeah, there's his line again. I'm always at full throttle. Rotation Battle, this is something new introduced in Pokemon Black. In Pokemon White, he'll be teaching you how to fight a triple battle, which is literally just a double battle with three Pokemon. Rotation Battles, in my opinion, are a little bit more interesting. And that Crocorock should not be a Crocorock. It should not. I call Foul. They evolve at level 29. Um, by the way, this is not the last illegal evolution that we'll be seeing in this game. Let's go for Leaf Tornado. He's going to avoid the attack, of course. He's going to hit me with a Swagger. All that swag. And uh, raise my attack to, to um, two stages and uh, confuse me. I don't want to be confused. So I'm going to swap to uh, my good friend Sock and have him use Brick Break. Okay. Swap into the fish. He's going to use Take Down. All right. Now, I think he's going to switch again. I'm just going to Brick Break. Aqua Jet. I don't like that. Alright, two Pokemon left. I think Zebstrika is probably going to be the uh, problem on his team. Oh, but he's switching to Crocorock. Awesome. Dark type is weak against fighting type. There we go. Problem solved. Now he can't uh, switch. And now uh, Zebstrika won't be much trouble at all because I can use Dig freely. I still can't get over the fact that Sock can use Dig. It's so weird. Does he, like, karate chop the ground and, like, blast himself a hole? I don't know. It's strange. You want to know something even stranger? Uh, three of my four Pokemon both know Rock Tomb and Dig. How strange is that? Let's uh, switch back to Malfoy and have him use Tackle, finish it off. Oh, this that was a good decision. I resist Spark. Paralysis. And he's still confused. Nasty. Back to black. Sorry, uh, sorry, Malfoy. And that's a win. That is a win. Level up for black. Level up for Petrie. And nothing for Malfoy. Okay, that's a rotation battle. Now you're up to speed. Sheesh, that's embarrassing. Getting schooled when I was planning to teach. Still, you have potential. You have to understand your Pokemon to win in a rotation battle. If you want to have more rotation battles, go to Opelucid City. Will do, eventually. Okay, uh, Cold Storage is up next. So we're going to heal our Pokemon. And by that, I mean I am going to heal my Pokemon. Because you viewers are not taking part in this whatsoever. I suppose that's not true. You are, you are watching these videos. So that's contributing. Wait, um... You are watching them, right? I don't think so. I haven't been getting m very many views lately on Yokai Watch or on Pokemon Black, but that's fine. I don't do it for the views. I don't do it for the subscribers. I just do it because I want to do it. <laughs>